guys, it's Nick at Film Tools. We're here at the Teradek booth at NAB 2012. We're here with Michael Galing, uh, marketing for Teradek, and uh, he's going to talk to us about some new products. Uh, Michael, what do we got? All right, so the biggest new product here is the brand new Cube, and it's more of an extension of the Cube family. It's not meant to replace any of the current Cubes we've already got for sale. So we've got a number of new hardware refinements, the most obvious of which is the new OLED screen built into the Cube here. And what this is going to do is give you all the functionality at the tips of your fingers. Um, you can do everything with these two little joysticks here, including changing the IP address, connecting to your network SSID, um, changing the uh, megabits per second that you want to broadcast, you name it. We've also got, you can see right here, dual antennas on the Cube now, which is uh, our new MIMO access point technology, which is going to get rid of the troublesome ad hoc connections we had with the old Cubes over the 2.4 gigahertz band. What this does now is it allows you to connect on a device-to-device -device basis over the 5 gigahertz band, so you don't experience a lot of the same kind of interference that we had before. We also have a, a micro SD card slot for onboard proxy recording, so as you're streaming, you can actually save an H.264 compressed file onto the, uh, the media. A micro USB slot, which will allow you to connect it to your computer so you can do configuration right there uh, instead of using the Ethernet port like we used to have to. And the other nice thing about this is that it also charges the internal battery, which we just introduced. And the internal battery in here will give you about two hours of runtime, which is great for uh, quick broadcasts, but it's also good for people doing long broadcasts that need to swap batteries out without having to power the unit down. Now, the Cube functions just like the old Cube does. It goes, uh, can transmit 1080p 30 over up to uh, 6 megabits per second over Wi-Fi, 10 megabits per second over Ethernet. And uh, on the top here, we've got a connection with uh, one of our newer units called Bond. And Bond is our cellular transmitter, and that's all it does. Um, it still uses the encoding out of the cube. Now, Bond will combine up to five 3G and 4G modems at one time, and you can broadcast over the cellular networks. And it's actually any carrier in the United States. We support almost all the modems available here and multiple modems from carriers around the world. Now, Bond will actually uh, adaptively adjust the bit rate um, as you go in and out of coverage areas, so you're never stuck trying to push a 720p video when you're uh, only with one modem left. It knows when to uh, bump it back up when you go in coverage and then back down when you lose coverage. Great, guys. That sounds awesome. Uh, check it out at filmtools.com.